Today is Good Friday, and for many, it is a day of reflection. And with the pandemic, churches had to change how they hold service. Local 33's Jonah Gilmore spoke to a Baton Rouge church that says they wove the new norm into their Good Friday message. It seems to be the longest Lent on record. The COVID-19 outbreak is changing the way we do everyday life, and that includes attending church. I think it's just a really neat learning opportunity for us as pastors and leaders of the church. Deidre Hellerburton is the associate pastor at St. John United Methodist Church. She says the pandemic gave them the idea to hold a service of life and breath. The service offers a unique opportunity. Around the country, people are feeling the effects of the virus. Everybody's um, feeling the weight of that. If, if it's not just the isolation, they're losing people in their families or loved ones. This Good Friday, St. John's allowed people to join in virtually, taking a different approach, healing. We wanted to have a service where we would offer people a place or a container for their own grief and struggle that they're experiencing. Halliburton says although the worship experience has slightly changed, the message and meaning remains the same. It's in telling our story, the struggles and the joys of our story, that we become the best person that we are, that we um, become who God intended us to be. Jonah Gilmore, NBC Local 33 News. Now, St. John's United Methodist will also be hosting a virtual Easter service. For ways to figure out how to tune in, you can visit our website. That's BRProud.com.